This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment, educational purposes only, and anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube album stuff so you get the videos I put them out. See what I'm thinking, see me analyzing that data. But like I tell you, every day, the data released us is false. I'm going to give us a false narrative of the market so we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, these bad actors are doubling down on their counterfeit GME shares in, in order to push the price down. Do you guys think at this point anybody's selling their GME shares? GME is sitting on over $4 billion in cash, hardly any debt, and a CEO who's a beast. Okay? I, in my opinion, and I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell GME, but it's only upside from now on with GME. Only on the upside, as far as I'm concerned. So, all these bad actors who are still shorting and naked shorting GME, it doesn't make any logical sense. Nobody shorts a company that's sitting on four point over four billion dollars in cash, hardly any debt, and a CEO who knows what he's doing, a CEO who cares about his shareholders. The only people shorting GME right now are the people who created billions of counterfeit GME shares and they can't get out of the plate. It makes no logical reason, it makes no financial reason to short GME because it is nowhere going to bankruptcy. That is not going to happen. And everybody knows this. So the only people that are still naked shielding GME, still pushing the price down, still engaging in criminal activity to rob retail investors, pension funds, and institutions that follow the law, are the GME Regal conspirators that created all these counterfeit GME shares, and now they can't get out. They can't logically explain their short position because GME is sitting on four over four billion dollars in cash. So how can they justify their short position? They can't justify it. The thing is they can't get out the plate. They created so many counterfeit GME shares that if they start to cover those shorts, GME is gonna go to the moon. But I believe when the CAT system data is released, it's going to show a lot of fraud, a lot of corruption in the GME plate, and that's going to force the SEC, the DOJ, and the FBI to do their job. It might even force the politicians to hold a hearing in Congress because I believe the malfeasance is going to be that out of control. Bottom line is this, anybody still shorting and naked shorting GME after they're sitting on over $4 billion is an absolute bad actor, bad actor, because only a criminal who couldn't escape the GME play right now would still be trying to short it. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think the only people shorting and naked shorting GME are the people that created billions of counterfeit GME shares and they can't exit the position. Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.